Invasive plants are spreading along the roads, really. So, and uh, they're spreading along the road verges, and then they can reach new habitats uh, and and spread in those. And uh, the problem is really massive. Uh, for example, in in one highway here north of Copenhagen, where in some parts of of the verges, almost 80% uh, of of the area is covered with Canadian goldenrod, and uh, that's a massive problem uh, that we cannot fight but we can stop the spreading. That's the goal. My name is uh, Kasper Müller and I'm a project manager for environmental uh, stuff at uh, the Danish Road Directorate. The main responsibility is obviously to ensure that the traffic uh, gets through uh, to where it needs to be. We have uh, a lot of uh, area that we're managed and uh, the road verges along the roads are obviously also uh, something that we need to manage. Invasive plants is uh, Plants that are not naturally occurring here, so they come from uh, other places in, in the world. But they don't have any natural enemies here, so they can uh, really overtake uh, natural areas uh, when they're spread. Yeah, previously there hasn't really been anything done. There are uh, a single species that we are, are combating. The idea of this project is to identify where new uh, developments of plants are occurring. If it's only a couple of meters, we have the economical uh, uh, power to, to fight them on this place so they don't spread. Uh, when developing this idea, initially we thought about having humans to identify the, the plants, but it's really not <laughs> that uh, feasible to have uh, people driving the cars and looking for plants at the same time. The first time we met Trifog, they were really engaged in the project and uh, from the start really uh, saw the possibilities and uh, they saw what, what we had in mind and uh, uh, came up with the very feasible solutions. Where the goal for, for this solution is that it, the system can identify 95% uh, of all uh, plants, invasive plants, and that it is correct in 95% uh, of the occurrences in detecting which plant species it is. The development process with uh, Trifog has uh, really been uh, excellent. We have uh, great communications uh, all the time, and uh, even though we come from different fields, the end goal of this uh, solution is that it is mounted on uh, the cars driving on the roads every day, so we can monitor the spreading of uh, new species. Obviously, we started here in Denmark, and uh, we are collaborating with uh, Sweden and Iceland as well, but we have, we have also uh, learning interest from uh, Germany, our neighboring country uh, as well, so, uh, and really, this, the solution is, is pretty simple. You can take it anywhere in the world and, and learn it, uh, new uh, plant species, and, uh, and use it straight away, actually.